Hey, thanks for tuning in. In this video, I will show you how to replace audio of a video without re-rendering the video file. So you maybe don't have access to the source files anymore, or you want to create multiple audio variations. Let's say you have multiple languages of a video file, and the process of re-rendering and putting this into editing software takes a lot of time. And I will show you an easier way how to do that. Let's get started. The software we will use in this example is AnchorPoint. AnchorPoint is a media asset manager that you can download for free and it has all the video and audio conversion tools. So AnchorPoint acts like a file browser, so you simply need to browse to the location where your video file is located. I already have done this, so I simply need to switch the tab. Here is my video file, which is basically a play blast, and in this case it has no audio at all, and I would like to attach an existing audio. For that I can add to a right click and say change audio of video, so if it would have an existing audio file, it would replace that basically. And here it asks me if I want to remove an audio, which I don't want in this case of course, and then I can add a new audio clip. Let me browse to it and choose this WAV file here. And then it asks me to take the longest length. So think about this, when your audio file is longer than your video file, AnchorPoint will create a new video file that is as long as the longer audio file. If you disable that, then it will take the length of the video file, which is shorter, and cut the rest of the audio away. And this is also true if the video file is long, it will of course take the length of the video file in this case. I leave it as it is and I simply click on convert. And now I have a new video file with the audio attached to it. Alright, that's all about it. If I want to tidy this up, I can simply enable the version stacking and now it created a stack of two video files together. So this looks a bit more tidy here in the browser. Alright, I hope this was helpful for you and thank you for watching. Bye bye.